this is more of an astrology report than an astrology alert when presumably you are talking about something that is coming up, whereas in this case, what I'm about to say has already happened. The full moon peak was earlier today at 8 a.m. Pacific, 10 Central, 11 a.m. Eastern. Then, for the next five hours, until 1 p.m. Pacific, 3 p.m. Central, 4 p.m. Eastern, the moon was what astrologers call void of course, which means that until it entered Taurus, at 1 p.m., 3 p.m., 4 p.m., it was not connected to any other planet by major aspect, as in conjunction, sextile, square, trine, or opposition. These periods when the moon is void, in this case five hours, but do realize that sometimes it might be an entire waking day, are blocks of time when the usual way to get things done tends to go a little or a lot off the rails. Tangents can appear where you're doing something and you get distracted by something else, or for whatever other reason, what you're trying to get done cannot seem to find the proper traction. These periods are also best avoided for important meetings or for making key decisions. However, what the Void Moon can be great for is brainstorming sessions where you just let anything come up without much structure because it is very possible a really creative idea will surface. It is also a great time to meditate. In a sense, you could see all of this as a kind of intelligent or strategic drifting. Let the mind go where it wants to go and notice what comes up. Now I'll end with a bit of entertainment by saying that the Orange Menace would not have liked this full moon period, which would broadly speaking be active during Monday and Tuesday, but then today it connected by square to its 12th sign Venus Saturn. And this is likely why the news reports are saying he issued a bitter statement regarding the indictment of one of his corrupt GOP cronies for lying to the FBI, and he's saying something about how there's no justice in this country because good men like that are being charged when people like Crooked Hillary and FBI agent McCabe are getting away with it. Right, Donald, you're definitely who we're all going to get informed by in regard to lying, since you're not just the world expert on the subject, you're like the ultimate cosmic manifestation of a lying machine. You lie machine gun style. Everything that comes out of your mouth is a falsehood. So we're definitely going to hear you loud and clear. We know exactly what you're saying. Or could it be that you're trying to condition your idiot followers for the certain upcoming day when you yourself will get indicted for one or more of your many lies and crimes? Then you'll be able to say, see, I told you I'm a good man and I'm being victimized. But sorry, Donald, most of America is on to you. You're a low-life crook and you're just going to get what is coming to you. And although I started this video saying I was reporting rather than alerting, here is an alert for you. Mars is just now moving into a square to his 12th sign Venus-Saturn conjunction. So you can anticipate lots of orange menace, rage and bitterness for the next week or so. This is all so unfair to poor Donald. Life can be just so unfair to all them liars and criminals. What an injustice. What a bummer. It really couldn't happen to a nicer guy.